Greetings, YouTube, and welcome to round number 16 for the hunt for four-star Corvus Glaive. If you enjoy tuning in just to see me not accomplish my goal of landing on the champion that I am after, then you have loved, you've adored this hunt because I'm currently over 45 on four-star crystals. I haven't even come close to landing Corvus in the real. Nevertheless, landing on him as a four-star champion, it is pretty crazy. Of course, I hear from you all every day. All of you send me your screenshots of your four-star corpse. Tell me he's your first four-star even. I mean, good for you. You know, I'm happy for you. Jealous, of course, but happy for you at the same time. This is also a, uh, a reminder that we need a four-star featured crystal in Marvel Contest of Champions. We need a 3,000 shard four-star featured crystal to have a much better chance of pulling a new champion for our collection or if you need a specific four star like a scarlet witch or a wolverine to awaken you'll have a much better chance to do that as far as drop rates are concerned from a featured than you would be the normal basic which is pump pushing what like 150 champs so we're going to open three because uh for those of you who don't know that that's how many it took for me to get killmonger i did a hunt for four star killmonger and i got him on the first hunt the only thing better than that is when I wasn't even hunting for six-star Domino and pulled her on negative one hunts. So that's going to be hard to beat. But uh, Corvus is kind of the opposite, being 0 for 45. But hopefully we're not 0 for 48 by the time that this is done. I, I know a lot of you have already skipped ahead to see who I've gotten, but I appreciate those of you who actually listen to every second of the commentary I try to put in as a recording, especially if you just happen to be, you know, in the bathroom and bored. That's, that's really where I shine. My commentary sounds way better when you are bored in the bathroom. I have learned that uh, the hard way. Okay, whatever that means, we're going to stop this now and see if Corvus can be rolled around. And, oh, oh, it's magic? Oh, no, but we're going to blast off with a rocket. And there you go. And he is indeed a Max Sig Crystal. So we will take absolutely the first crystal. Yes, it's a miss, but if I miss... I want that max sig crystal. I want more five-star shards, more chances for six-star shards. It's always a good decision to uh, to do that. So I'm, uh, you know, trying to stay optimistic. You're not going to get everything you want in this game, or most of the time you're pretty much going to get nothing that you want. I had somebody recently uh, send me a picture of three straight iron fists in, uh, in a five-star crystal, and that is not ideal either. But uh, let's see who we get in the second crystal. We're going to stop that sucker now, see if we can get a second Max Sig crystal or something other. And, oh, that's a new champ, and it could have rolled off a Red Skull to a second Red Skull. I always love pulling new champs. And even though this guy is by far the worst champion of 2018, I always want to add every champ to my collection, and we can do that now. I once pulled a new champion and then duped him on back-to-back four-star crystals. I'm not saying it's going to happen here, but it could. I'm digging this. Rocket Raccoon, Maxi Crystal, new Red Skull. Life is good. I'm very, very happy with this. Now, if you want to throw me a four-star ghost as well, I, I certainly wouldn't mind that. I've been ghosted by her enough as it is, but she's invisible, so I guess that's just coming with the territory, isn't it? Man. I don't remember last time I got a new champ from a four-star crystal. That's very exciting. I just assume from now on I'm going to get like a 2015 champ, and that's going to be it. I've still also never pulled Blade out of this crystal. I've only have him because of the four-star basic arena. All right, here we go. We're stopping this crystal. We're going to dupe our Red Skull in two crystals. That'd be a crazy thing to call. There's Corvus, and oh, it's fatty. And hey, hey, Ghost would have been great too. Corvus at least was on the reel. That's the first time we've seen that in a long time. And uh, Fatty is now maxed out to Sig 99, so there you go. But uh, no, we're going to take off this uh, this trash offer very much. Thank you. Red Skull. Ah. Somebody who uh, probably needs a new nose, you know, just, just being honest. But when in doubt, you know, if you want to know how I get so many five stars so quickly, it is because of duplicating my four-star crystals. Nothing makes me happier than duplicating my four-star 
crystals and making them max sig. So, man, round number 16 for Corvus Glaive is in the books. We are now 0 for 48. So, if you love seeing me miss, you have just loved this hunt. Maybe it will never end. We have three shots at them each time, and that still doesn't mean anything. But uh, here's to hoping round number 17 actually works out well. Thanks for watching so much, YouTube. Have a great day, and good luck in all of your personal hunts in your crystal openings in the game.